everyone. We are running errands today. And one errand is when we went to Walmart, uh, a cashier, she was seemed to be having some problems. And uh, I still don't know if she did one thing right. But anyway, we got some baby wipes that were $6.87 and she charged us twice for them. So, even though it cost us some gas to go back there, I mean, that's, I'm not going to just let that go, you know. Uh, I don't know how many times we've caught mistakes there. A lot, isn't it, Troy? I mean, some of them were some major mistakes, too. And I looked at the receipt, I just, everything's so abbreviated and stuff on their receipts, you can't hardly tell what it is to begin with. And then... You know, and then this this uh, receipt is light, like they were low on ink, and it also has places where you can't even tell what something is. It's like too light, but you can see where they charge for the um, where she charged for the wipes twice at least. Uh, so they need to give us that money back. So aggravating and. Uh, I talk about it in the uh, hall, uh, but they uh, she messed up on something else. It was what well, we got some pepperoncinis and some uh, banana pepper rings, and the the jars looked about the same because they're both great value. And uh, she charged, uh, she just rang up one of them twice, and they were different. And I didn't know if they were different price or not, so I said. Uh, you rang up that with just one of them and those are two different items and uh, so she went back and tried to fix it but I, I don't know she kept she kept putting them on and taking them off there's three places on this receipt where she was I, I trying to figure out I guess what she did and I can't ever I can't figure out whether we ended up paying for another one or if she did it right or not uh, but just always something it seems like it looks like it'd almost be best best to uh, self check out there if they can't uh, if their cashiers can't seem to get the the orders right um, here I'll hold on to this can you can you twist it? Water. did you want some so here's the new this is beside Aldi here and we at least know one thing that's going to be in there is a, an advance auto. So, which isn't very much use for us. We were hoping there'd be some cool little shops in there and stuff. I mean, there'll be some other ones, but it looks like advance is taking up most of that building. If not all. It acted like by the picture there's going to be like different little shops there. Maybe they're gonna, I don't know why they're digging in front of the advance. It looks like that would be a parking lot right there. They're digging down like they're gonna build something else almost. I don't know. It's a little rainy. It's actually supposed to be raining more than this right now, isn't it, Joy? Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be storming right now. So we can't mow or anything like that. It's not really time yet to mow anyway but it seems like it's growing really fast which it is I mean because of the all the rain we've had then we gotta take a item back to send to Amazon uh, and for some reason we gotta take it to they want us to take it to uh, UPS instead of uh, Kohl's.
kind of dreary. There's another Dollar Tree back in there, but we never go to that one anymore. Hey, let's check it out while we're here. We we don't go to many. We don't go to Dollar Tree. We're gonna go in, uh, at all, really. So here. we just got a bunch of stuff from there, though. So yeah, I hope we really true. need to go. Might have been able to get that bottle washer, uh, bottle brush, or whatever there, but we already got it at Walmart. Get the discount and we do a Kroger. We got a bunch of Kroger points. <coughs> we got like a thousand points. I'd make it about 40 cents off or more. Probably. At least. So we buy our, our fuel usually at Kroger. Uh, they I have a gas station. Like yeah. It's going quarter tank. I don't care. It'll go a long way on a quarter tank, this car. <coughs> Let's see. I'm going to I'm gonna pause this for now. We'll let you know what happened. Look at this dude. All right. He's not going, but that's his problem. I just finally saw it. Uh... Well, they they put the money back on the, I guess, healthy benefits must have paid for those. I didn't know they even paid for uh, baby wipes. But anyway, uh, only problem, I mean, that'll work out fine. Uh, I don't know how long it takes to get back on the uh, healthy benefits card. But what we've run into with that before is we came over here before, like on the last day of the month or something like that, because... Uh, our, our check had already gone in or something early and we shopped early so when we I went back that same day and got something and they said they put it back on the card well the only problem with that was uh, when the if you're uh, if you have a balance on your healthy benefits card uh, except for rewards they'll leave rewards on there but as far as your what you get each month uh, if you don't use it, you lose it. It doesn't roll over, which I don't agree with at all. But it doesn't roll over, so you've got to use all of it. So since I had that put back in at the last day of the month, the next day it disappeared. You see what I'm saying? I mean, it, 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 it didn't roll over. So we got credited there at the end of the month, and I didn't, we didn't get it, you know, we didn't get it because it, it just expired. So that, that's one thing I don't like about the way they, they do the refunds on stuff that's on the healthy benefits card. Um, and really, it's more the insurance company uh, having them expire that is the problem than it is you know that Walmart did. Uh, so there's little things you gotta watch out for, you know. You've got to use it all, but I, I'm pretty sure like the rewards you get for exercise and like getting a flu shot or uh, uh, an exam, a physical exam or whatever, um, I think those rewards, they, they don't expire. I think they stay on there, but we always use them, so I'm not for sure about that, if it goes away or not, but I think it stays on there. It wouldn't be right for them to take your rewards away, in my opinion, but they may do it too. I'm just not sure because we always use them right away. Um, so, 
can be aggravating sometimes, but it's still worth it. It's a big benefit. Yeah, down here you're going to have to help me. Okay. See these mountains up here. UPS up up here on the right is that super Kroger we went to uh, a while back it's nice but it's just this area is always um, crowded or you know a lot of traffic it's hard, kind of hard to get out I mean you can get out no problem you have to come down here behind it right and come out right over there where that car is and then you come up to this light and turn left. There's Aramark. I haven't seen them in a long time. I used to work for them. They had a, a vending company, but they do uniforms mainly, Aramark. Well, are we gonna get to go get this? These lights down this street here are too long. Yeah. Car, barbecue. Yeah, that's what I was telling you. Uh, you can turn in right down there. Yeah, that's where we're gonna go. Yeah, that's where we went that one time. What's that up there? It's closed, whatever that was. Pizza it was a restaurant. Was that the Pizza Hut? I'm wondering. Hmm. No, I thought Pizza Hut was back there. There's Earth Fair. That's expensive to shop there, boy. Ooh. They got good stuff, but it's expensive. See that place down there? It's called Biscuit something. Now, that was Bojangles. Biscuit Doodle or something, it says. Oh, let's see. Biscuit Doodle. I don't even know if they're open. I bet they've already closed up. Okay, I'm going to pause it. All right, everybody. We decided to go ahead and stop this for now. We're going to just go on home after this anyway. Um, I was thinking about going to Evergreen, but I don't, I don't believe we're going to grow any eggplants. I'm going to put that uh, Texas Red Hill okra where I was going to mm. put the three eggplants because we eat more of it probably than we do eggplants. You can buy an eggplant instead of having to grow 10, uh, 10 plants or whatever. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this out and about with Mike and Joy. And if you did, please press that like button. Also, subscribe if you haven't already and share this out. And hit that notification bell so that you get all our videos as soon as they come out. Bye, everyone. Have Bye -bye. a great day.